welcome back you guys so this one's just a little quick little pick me up i am dragging don't you love my new god it's so cute anyway um so this is just what i do i make cold brew now that it is getting into the warmer weather so i will show you what i do i want to make some caramel because i prefer a caramel over chocolate and when I made it today I tried to OD on chocolate so don't add as much chocolate as I did I ended up making chocolate milk with a little bit of cold brew So I am going to fill it full of ice because the colder the better for me and I didn't want to blend it because I'm already doing a million other things and so I'm going to put some chocolate which like I said way too much even for it doesn't look like that much it just was too much I'm going to use my half and half or you can use milk I've done both half and half was just easier for me to grab and then I will fill up the rest of it with cold brew and I recommend if you've got a lid go ahead and take the, the straw of the lid because this is a Starbucks cup shake it I put the straw in put the lid on after stirring thinking I had stirred it enough I was incorrect I got a mouthful of chocolate um, maybe that's why I didn't care for it. <laughs> I just, you know, once I tasted it incorrectly, it was it. But, um, oh, and I did the pumps of caramel. And so I did one yesterday. It was simple. And I didn't do the chocolate with it. And so it's kind of why I want to try. Maybe tomorrow I'll make some caramel. And then I'll have it for my coffee. Anyway, thank you guys again for joining us. I know it's a really short one, but this is the perfect amount. It's not got a lot of caffeine, especially if it's later in the day and you guys can't handle it. Alright, see you guys tomorrow. Love you.